Welcome back. This is Ms. Gradinchic. I am the 7th grade and 8th grade math teacher at Syracuse STEM at Blodgett. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to navigate to your class notebook. So the way we do that is from the main dashboard here in Teams, you're going to click on the class that you're in. All right. Now, again, if you're not seeing this screen, one way to get to the main dashboard or to the um, part of Teams that you need to be in is by looking at this menu bar on the left hand side and just click on Teams, you know, a couple of times and it's going to take you to this um, dashboard area here. So once you, um, let's say your first class of the day is Math 8 with Ms. Gradinchich, you're going to click on that. And one of the first things you're going to do is you're going to join your class. So if it was 8.45 right now, you would see one of these like purple banners on here and there would be a button on it to join but it's Sunday so there is no join right now and in the previous video I did show you how to join your live class sessions either through the individual teams or through the calendar right so I'm not going to repeat that at this point so assuming that you are already in your live class session you're going to get to this you're going to flip uh, you're going to tab over to this screen um, in your Teams and you're going to look on the um, upper portion of your screen for a menu bar and you're going to have posts, files, class notebook, assignments and grades. You're going to click on class notebook. So now that the class notebook is opened up, you're going to navigate to the section or the page that your teacher wants you to navigate to. So there's like a little sideways arrow button next to welcome to class notebook you're gonna click on that and that's gonna open these two sections or two um, menu rectangles all right on the left hand side here you're going to have some folders welcome collaboration space content library um, you're not going to have the teacher only because you're not a teacher and you're gonna have your name as a teacher, I have all of the other students listed on here. So for you, um, you're going to have a much smaller list of folders. What you're going to do is once you are in your class, you're going to click on your name. And that's going to open up like three subfolders or three sections within your class notebook. If you're working on something with your teacher in the class, your teacher will likely ask you to open up your handouts folder once you do that then you're going to have in this area here you're going to have a list of pages that are inside of that folder your teacher will tell you which page he or she wants you to be on and so let's say they want you to be on do it now day one you're gonna click on that once the page opens up in this area you can click anywhere in the page and it's going to make your page bigger and then you can work on it now let's say that you completed with this activity and you want to go back to a different page because your teacher is instructing you to do so again you're going to click on this button here it's a sideways arrow and now you can see again all of the other pages that are available to you to work on all right and then the same goes for all of the other folders in your class notebook your teacher will instruct you which folder to open up so now let's say your first period math class is completed and you need to get to your other classes. The way you do that is very easy. Again, you're going to um, look for the far left vertical menu bar and you're going to look for the Teams icon. Click on Teams once or twice and it's going to take you to the main dashboard here. And then basically you just click on the class that you want and repeat the process.